Episode 3, bot line. Let's go. Right now. Let's go. Huh? Get him in here. Soccer ball. Get him in here. Aiden. I saw it. You're on the line with Krim Sax. What's your question? Alright, Krim. Yep. What's this going on, Aiden? Survival. You gotta go to an island. Yep. You can only bring three things. What are you bringing and why? An island. Is what it people question. there? Is it, am I by myself? You are by yourself. Alright, I'm bringing... Some sort of fire starting kit. I am bringing a fresh water, uh, like a, ah, fuck. Oh, that's tough, man. <laughs> I'm bringing like a, a, a fresh, something that I can convert fresh or salt water into fresh water or, or a bowl or something to catch a, or capture rainwater. And then, uh. Probably a, like a machete or something, or yeah, some, some, so, so, something sharp. Okay. That, that, Thank you for your question. That's my Aiden. question. I'm surviving 100. percent What's up, Yo, Seal? Yep. Awesome. Yo, what's going on? Okay, my question is, would you pick not having Dana or not being able to play COD ever again? Whoa. Oh my God. <laughs> Which one? You know, I don't, I don't deal in absolutes. I'm picking both. <laughs> that's, that's, that's my answer. Thanks for your question, Seal. Yeah, no problem. You'll have a good night, man. A turnip. Oh, What's shit. your question? <laughs> Yo, Krim. What's going on, man? What's going on, turnip? Why do you pussies drive automatic cars, man? <laughs> I don't know, bro. It's just, it's just... I guess it's just the way they're brought up, bro. Fucking millennials. <laughs> Generation X, dude. Fuck out of here, man. I actually, do, I actually do have an automatic car, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Layer pack. You're on the line with Krim6. What's your question? Hey, Krim. Assuming it's the off season, and like TJ has to go back to the Shire, or like Dashy has to save Gotham City, <laughs> like, uh, what pros would Practice you? How you're gonna fucking pick? play, you fucking Chris. Right now? Uh, like assuming it's the off season, like no contractual issues, like anyone. Oh, I see what you're doing here. <laughs> I see what you're doing. Uh, Hook, and probably Gunless. Yeah, who can gun this? Thanks for the question, that's what, I, that's what I would say. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. Man. Torque! You're on yeah, the line with Cream 6. Man. What's your question? What's up? What's up, man? Uh, How's it going? Pretty good. How about y'all? Good, man. Good. Great. Hanging okay, up. so do y'all think that that CWL will ever turn back to Xbox? No. It won't? No, not a, no, yeah. like like an ice cube has a better chance of surviving hell than that happening. <laughs> like, Facts. It's Actual not fact. it's not happening. If you got Xbox, sell that shit. But don't. No, don't, no, I don't have Xbox. Yeah, but yeah, I, was just, I was just asking. Don't, don't don't try to go into a fucking GameStop and sell that shit. Might end up yeah. in a brawl, dude. Those GameStop brawls are the fucking funniest shit. I've ever seen, dude. <laughs> for real. Thanks for the question, right, thank you. Trick. You're on the line with Krim Six. What's your question? <clears throat> okay, throughout your whole career, all events you've been to, what's the weirdest thing someone's brought up to you and asked you to sign? Uh, Montreal. Someone brought a giant sausage, like, like this big, like I'm, and it was some sort of Canadian sausage, and I signed the sausage. Like uh, the physical sausage. Like an actual, like, like Italian actual sausage. sausage. Like, like they <laughs> brought an Italian sausage. They somehow got it through security. Cause you can't fucking bring food in, so I don't know how the fuck this guy got a giant sausage that was about like two feet long, si <laughs> signed a sausage, and nice. then we and then we didn't lose a series the rest of that tournament. So that was a good luck sausage. Right, Shout well, out to him. When I come to Dallas, I'll sneak in a sausage. He can sign it then again. All so. right, man. Good luck with that. <laughs> <laughs> it might Thanks be a little bit question. harder now. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, man. I'm gonna that get car. great grilled by the chat because I'm a complete squeaker, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I didn't mean to say that, yo. Yo, what's up, man? man? Yo, what's, what's up, Prim6? Yo, what's up, man? What's up, bro? <laughs> what's your question? Uh, my question is, who's your most favorite pro and your least favorite pro? Favorite pro is probably Clay, J-Cap, or... Uh... Man, I need a fucking list of teams. I mean, that's enough, bro. You said two. Okay, two. Those, either one of those two. And least favorite... Donnie has to go in there. <laughs> no, no, I don't actually. Donnie, see, Donnie shit talks, but it's actually funny. Like, 
When people Pharaoh. shit talk and it's not funny, Pharaoh, there you go. Me and him don't really get that. He fucking despises Pharaoh. Yeah, just because of the pistol. Uh, he uses pistols, that's it. Thanks for the question, man. Don't, don't really have a, yeah, yeah, no problem, bro. Don't really have a personal problem with him, but, mm-hmm. you know, he, he, kill, he kills me with pistols for like two fucking years. I don't look at him. Years. I don't talk to him when I see him. You know, <laughs> it, it, yeah. you know, if he tries to dab me up, I'm looking at him like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the question, man. All right, good night. Just, just only because he kills me with pistols. Strobes, you're on the line with Crim6. What's your question? All right. This is a this is a, gonna be a, a nice little joke, right? All right? Okay, better. Okay. All right. What did Stephen Hawking say when he died? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. I don't know. <laughs> oh my oh god. My god. <laughs> oh, my god. oh my god. The disrespect. That'll just back to back three <laughs> things that are just. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Small Dilf, we're trying you one more time. Are you? Hello. Hello, Small Dilf. What's up, man? Hey. What's your question? How you guys doing? Good, good. Hey, Krim. How big is your cock in inches? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm back, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this guy's voice sounded fucking familiar, bro. He I did that last time. I knew, I knew it was this fucking guy, bro. <laughs> Oh Sorry my for that god. horrific joke. That's so funny. Oh my god. I knew that guy. I heard that guy's voice. I was like, oh shit. I just knew it was that fucking guy, bro. I'm back, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Harvey, you're on the line with Crim Sex. What's your question? Whoa. I love What's you, up, first off. You're my thank dad. You, it's it's Garvey, you. but it's okay. You're my son. Garvey. Really? Oh, thank you. Thank you, man. Um, so, um,. 20 or let me who's your favorite artist like music wise Ooh, i don't think i have a favorite yeah. i'm like i'm like i'm dude i'm like uh pretty much just every day like my music taste like changes not, not cha- genre yeah, yeah 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 like like some days i'll go like rock pop punk like punk all this shit and then the next day i'm listening to fucking drake uh drake. who else little peep little peep like I think I saw you listen to yeah, nothing nowhere. Is that, is that yes. right? Yeah, My friend. Yeah, 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 yeah. I went to go see him live in Kansas. Oh, really? Yeah. That's dope. Hella opening acts, but yeah, pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I don't think a lot of people know about that guy. Uh, I was gonna ask, why do you look like every movie school bully? Uh, I don't know, dude. I don't know. I'm ho- hopefully, hopefully, I'm going more towards a Thor look, dude. The discount Thor. Oh yeah, you're pretty brolic. Thank you, dude. <laughs> All right, Alex. Thanks thank for you, the man. questions. All right, peace, Crim Sex. Later, man. Uh, Donnie, you're online with oh, Crim hey. Sex. What's, what's up, question? Donnie? How's it going, bro? Yeah, what's up, bro? I have to say, huge fan, huge fan. Thank you. Well, uh, I got to mute your stream here three times. Um, my question is, how did you feel during your first event, like nerves-wise? Uh, I didn't really feel. I, I was just, I was just so happy to be there. I just had a blast and and the fact that you know i was like i'm like i didn't even think about that shit. i was just like dude i'm doing what i want to do you know uh, yeah and to me there wasn't really nerves it was like uh, i was just like a, a kid on christmas pretty much uh i i mean i don't know I, I was i didn't feel nervous at all yeah i feel like i'd personally feel nervous like all those people watching and stuff you think i was so? just curious yeah, I would definitely be a little nervous. I don't know, man. I I I think once you get there and and you know if you're really passionate about video games and and esports, then then you like like you don't even think about that stuff. You just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like like pretty much from your first couple events, it's like I'm. It's been a while, so I'm trying to think back. But I mean, I was just so happy to be there. I felt like you know all my work that I put in is come to this and. Now it's just time to play. So I'm having a tough time convincing my parents to grind it out, and I've been winning a lot more now. And yeah. what would be? How did you convince your parents to let you play more? Uh, it's pretty much like showing like sponsors that are involved. Uh, you know how much people are actually making. Just basically putting like a monetary value on like, uh, you know, people like pro players and how much like they're bringing in and. And basically the, the fact that there's a future in this 
that is, you know, it's it's ever expanding pretty much. Uh, there's, I mean, back then, back then it was like pretty much a hobby. Like I've been playing since it was a hobby. I was I was there since when it was a hobby. Uh, it turned into a profession. So, um, my, I would say that like my timeline, my time frame was a little probably a lot different than yours. Probably a lot harder because now there's like there's pro players making so much money like so much money in terms of like salary you know social media all that stuff uh and uh it's it's completely different now than how it was back then but now it's a profession so uh, i would say just do some research show your parents and and uh go with that <laughs>